Hey everyone, welcome to this video. My name is Jan Zuiderduin and I'm the founder of LearnSolidWorks.com. And in this short video, I'm going to show you how to measure a length in SolidWorks. And for this lesson, we will use this Boeing 747 assembly. So if you want to measure the length of this plane, for example, you can go to Evaluate and click on the Measure icon. Now we're going to select the front of this Boeing right here. And we're going to select the end point of the vertical stabilizer right here. And now you can see the total length is 7,688 millimeters. But of course it makes more sense to measure the horizontal length. So therefore we're going to click on this icon. And as you can see right here, the length of this plane is around 75,000 millimeters. But we can also change this to meters. Therefore, we click on this button and we change the length unit from millimeters into meters. Select meters, click OK. And now you can see this. The length of this plane is, is about 75.7 meters long. We can also measure the wingspan of the plane. So we select the first point and we select the second point. And you can see the wingspan of this plane is about 68 meters long. But you can also measure other things like the center to center. So for this example, we're going to zoom in on the wheels and we can, with the center to center option, we can measure the center from this wheel to the center of this wheel. And this is around one and a half meters long. We can also measure the diameter of the wheel by clicking on the edge right here. And the diameter of this wheel is around 1.39 meters. All right, guys, that's all for this lesson. Now, if you want to learn SolidWorks yourself, I want you to know that I've created a SolidWorks Boeing 747 video training course. And in this video training course, I'm going to show you exactly how to model this Boeing 747 all by yourself in SolidWorks. So if this sounds good to you, you can click on the link in the description under this video. And there you will get instant and free access to the first video of this video training course right away. Alright guys, that's all for now. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also make sure to click on the link in the description under this video to start modeling this plane yourself in SolidWorks. Alright guys, that's all for now. Thanks for watching and talk to you soon. Bye bye.